Hi guys, welcome back to Rock Review. Today we're gonna unbox some coach hauls. Yay! Let's get started. I bought some reserves from the coach outlet, which is really mean that they are from the boutique and they for some reason went to the coach outlet site, but they are from the boutique and you're able to purchase it through the outlet. It's called the reserves when you go online, coachoutlet.com. Usually when you get those dust bags, means it's from the boutique only the boutiques are giving them out even though you purchased them there let's get started i got two boxes first one is this let's put this box out this is what i got it is the cog turn lock pouch that is the product code 3010 in the color emerald I did open these already, just put them back just to show you how they look like. And isn't that pretty? It's just small though. But it's so, so pretty. These are the type of leather that gets scratched easily, which is, uh, you know, but I'm pretty sure you, if you just buff it out, it might go. It looks like it has a gold hardware. It has this plastic there I might keep. You can see it says coach right there at the bottom. Original price was $2.50, made in Vietnam. Emerald on the go turn lock pouch. I'm gonna try to take all these stuffings out and I'll be right back. This is how it looks like. Isn't it so cute? I love this color. It looks like it's teal on the light, but it's dark green. I'll try to find a picture because I did buy this a while ago. Like, I'll put it around here if I find the color. It is green emerald green so it's coming off as teal let me try to go here so that's how it looks it's because of my lighting oh so you're in a bright light that's how it looks like tealish green this does not come off where it's like antique gold you have these stitches that are like lighter green it's very pretty there's no feet it says original Club tan leather. That's different. I've never seen that in the bottom. It's very soft, but this is the type of leather. If you accidentally like scratch it, you will see it. But I'm not sure if you can buff it out. I've seen videos that you can. So be very careful. It is a small bag. It looks in the back. And on the side, you have these crease that goes on the side because of this um, flap same here on the side and you have this emerald green tag as well you have this pocket which is plus as well so this is also leather inside wow it's very beautiful i love how it feels in your hand so let's see what's inside it's very tiny by the way i mean it's not too hard to open but it's leather throughout wow this is very nice. You have this pocket in here. You can put your cards. And it does come with the dust bag, which is good. Because this leather is very sensitive to scratches. <laughs> so this is just like a canvas pouch. Oh, here's the care card. That's cool. Care card. For many, oh, it's not. It has like color stuff in there. Oops. And this is just a really hard. Oh, this certificate of authenticity. This one's from the Coach Reserves, which I bought from the outlet, but it is from the boutique. They just have the ones from the boutique usually under their reserves. This is the 1941 collection, which is amazing. So it's just again a canvas for you to put your bag inside let's get back to the bag so inside the bag we have the logo i don't know if you can see it's kind of hard to there you go it's right there and then you have this antique looking simple pull and you have a canvas in here oh and you have another care card care instruction odd 
so that's how all it's very simple and that's how it looks like super cute this one only comes with five instead of seven adjustments and i do love how this is has gold hardware very beautiful so for this one i paid I try to find the purchase and i'll find i'll put the price here once i find it and i'll let you know how much it is i know it's under 200 super pretty so, all right let's move on to the next one the next one is this it is the signature cc parker saddle 75577 in tan and rust is the product code in case you're interested again this is from the Couch reserve they had a sale end of october and i just happened to browse through this and i found some of the cutest bag but this one this one i just found and i thought it was interesting bag that's why i bought it so it comes with this satin instead of the cloth this is more like satin feeling and it's ta-da super cute so why i like this bag i wasn't planning on buying this bag but it struck how interesting it is that you can change the color by just turning it around like there's like two bags in one look at that this is ox blood by the way it looks purple in this video but it is ox blood i'll try to find a picture and i'll put it here okay, what it looks like so let's review the bag this is well i guess it doesn't matter what you consider the front i'll consider this the front because it has a signature logo and that's how it looks you have the turn lock key also has a logo here and this leather black leather smooth black leather all throughout the bottom it's like an accordion so this separates each flap so this flap is for this side and there's like a separator in between so it is like a two bag color and this is for this side so that's how it looks on the side again it's like an accordion you do have this black tag with antique hardware and you have it's like a collar block as well and you have this tan looking leather that weaves through this antique chain and also this one this what is this also has that logo on the sides like the other side so you have these two turn lock keys so it just depends if you want to keep it like on a down low and don't want to see the show the cc too much you can turn it around and it has this logo as well here and here and what i love about this bag is you can put more stuff here so if you can put your mask here it's not too big like as you can see that's all you can fit you can probably put your phone if it's smaller than mine super cute for you that you can adjust this chain just pulling on one side so let's say if you want to wear this side and as a crossbody you can my height is 5'4 so this it's too high for me when it's the way it lands on my body i don't like but if i really need to go crossbody it it'll work so if you're shorter this would be the bag for you if you like to wear crossbody otherwise you can just wear it as a shoulder bag or as a top handle as well so that's how it would look like so you just pull which side you want to wear if you want to wear the ox blood which comes out brown purple burgundy in the bright light and that's the darker let's light. go ahead and open this side so this is suede or throughout you have this black leather it's not it's probably not a, yeah it's a different leather from here this is the one that's softer this one's more smoother so you can see this is shinier so i'm pretty sure you can this will scratch easy as well but that not as much as this for sure but they both could be so it's not much space because of the other side but this is just still super cute bag the only con i don't like about it is the short strap and that if you carry a lot like me i feel like it could use a little bit more space but i 
could live with that it's just the strap is what's throwing me off um so i'm not sure about the strap if that's like a, a con for you then yeah i would not buy this bag there's no way to change this strap unless you take it off which i'm not gonna do it's just too much work and also for the price i mean it's not super expensive i believe it is 158 but again i'll double check on that this side of the bag is also suede so it's the same as the other side but this one has a card holder so the original price for this bag is 395 10 russ signature cc parker saddle 75577 is the product code this has a leather card slots you have the fear card and no magnets there's nothing else there so you only have this side for the card holder super cute yeah, you have this logo here, but no card holder on this side where the CCs are. All right, let's move on to the next one. The next one um is this is the last one. This the mixed leather brown dreamer shoulder bag seven six zero four five. The color Oxblood. All right, let me move this. So I got, I'm pretty sure you have an idea what I got already. This also comes with a dust bag. Again, these three bags are from the reserve section of the coach outlet. It also means that it's from the boutique. It's just on sale. It comes with a dust bag and it's satin. And this is what I got. Yay! So again, this is the Dreamer in Oxblood. Super pretty. It has this antique rivets, gold looking all throughout. So I saw this last year and I wanted it, but it got sold out pretty quick. So I paid more than last year, which was $220 plus tax. Now it's like on sale. I guess I should have waited. I feel like it was gonna sold out again, but it's still there. Um, as of today, again, this is being shot before Black Friday, so it might be gone by then. So it's 207 I believe, with the 25% discount. I'm not sure how much it's gonna be lower on Black Friday. Again, these are all pre-recorded videos, and that's how it looks. And the sides with the rivets, you have this pebbled on the sides. I just love the rivet look. I love this bag. Oh, and it's suede inside. Super soft. You can definitely fit your big phone there. It has this marking already. Oh no, it's just a crease. And then that's how it looks. You have this beautiful C logo and your coach tag here. The whole thing is ox blood with the antique color rivets. There's no feet. You have this soft leather here again very beautiful and you have suede trimmings and that's how it looks on the top all right let's see what's inside so there's two flaps like a chanel so on this side you have the chain i guess i took it off so it comes with two straps it's suede inside so what i like about this strap is it's not as heavy as the cassie which i like I don't know why the Cassie was so heavy, but if you guys don't mind that, that's up to you. But I do, because the bag itself is already heavy. A chain on top of that would be too heavy. But this is pretty light compared to the Cassie chain, um, Cassie 19. That one's pretty heavy and I haven't used that chain because it's so heavy. It comes with two straps. So inside the main bag, you have another strap, which is this oxblood that matches the bag. It has the logo right there on both sides. It has a gold antique color as well. It has the civic adjustment here. So I have the buckle there. It has the coach logo. So inside you have three parts compartment. One in the zip, it's two, and then in the back. So it's pretty big and it's weighed all around, which I love. You have that logo there. And the zip here for your important items. And inside the zipper area is all just canvas material. It says Coach logo. And this care card. And that's how it looks inside. 
And the zipper also has a logo on it. Super cute. Let me go ahead and put the straps on. So that's how it will look like with the leather strap. I already have it in the lowest setting, which I like. You also have hair. I guess you can fold this all the way in and it could be just like a shoulder strap instead of this long strap, which is super cool. And that's how it would look like. Original price for this was $5.50. I don't know if I mentioned that. Of course, I paid $220 with this plus tax. I'll show you how it looks like with the chain. All right, this is how it looks like with the chain. Super cute. All right, now let's see what we can fit in these bags. So, for the first bag, the Emerald Bag Parker. Let's, it's pretty tiny. So let's see what we can fit in this bag. So usually I would just put the mask in here. The lotion. So I'm basically, you could only fit essentials in here. Most importantly, let's see if it fits the phone. Hoping it does. Okay, it does, but look, it's just super tight in there, guys. I have to take this one. Yeah, it's tight. So it fits your. That's a Pro Max iPhone. It fits. There's the paper ring right there. And you could technically just wear it like a car holder and be done with it, unfortunately. So maybe if we do it sideways, we can put make this as your wallet. It's the small version of the my favorite wallet, which is the this wallet currently. It'd be too big with the phone unless I put my phone in my pocket or coat pocket. And this is pretty tight, so I mean, it won't fit my phone here for sure. It probably can stand up, and that would be it. Let's just show you how it looks. So that's how it looks with stuff inside. It's not heavy because you can't put much inside. Um, let's see if I take off the phone. These two out and put my actual wallet, which is this. So I have still the same thing, which is the emergency kit, the mask, and the lotion in there. So that much you can put in there. And I guess you can put this sideways and put some more stuff on this side. Like a sanitizer, maybe. And maybe a lipstick. So that would be it. And then your phone, you could probably slip it in this side. If you really need a holder. And that's how it would look like. You can't really put it sideways, unfortunately, because it's a small bag. And that's how it looks like. Super cute. The next one is this bag. So one side's gonna be my phone and maybe my mask. It's very tight. See how slim it is? That's it. Maybe lipstick on top and a pen if you really need it. That's how it looks. And close it. And then the next side, you probably put your wallet. Again, uh, ideally, you want to wear something slimmer, like a card wallet, would fit in there. You probably don't bring this, like as me, 
but I need to bring that emergency kit. And then this would be your coin purse. So that would be it, guys. And we do have this slot here. Let me try to put my phone in there instead. But again, it will stick out because I have a bigger phone and I have this pop it in the back. And I'm pushing it, which I don't like, but it does fit in there. If I need to have something to hold it while I'm busy, it's like sticking out. It's very ugly. So I might put it back inside. You can also put your mask in here as well. Alright, and that's how it would look like. Super cute. Alright, let's try the next bag. Let's see what we can fit in this Dreamer Oxblood Ribbits bag. So, let's put the mask in this side. Actually, let me put my phone there. And the battery charger helps fit there too. And think that's it. I don't want to put the master. Well, actually, I can just leave it in there. That's it for that side. Just snap that on. And then here you can put. The emergency kit, the wallet, the Louis Vuitton coin zippy, cards, my headset, lotion. Pretty much didn't put anything here. And I think that's it. Oh, and my sanitizer and lipstick. Pretty much all I have. Right, and it fits perfectly. And that's how it would look like with stuff inside. You could also put your phone in this side. Let me try to do that. If that's where I would prefer it. And that's yeah, that's the iPhone Pro Max. It fits in there. And that's how it would look like. Let me zoom out. That's how it would look like. Super cute, not too heavy. All right, guys, that's it for today. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And also, don't forget to check out my other videos and playlists. Thanks for watching. Bye. Have a wonderful day.